Hello guys and welcome to Tech Design. In this tutorial, I'm just going to explain you how we can work with a bridge bend command. So bridge bend command will be existing over here. As you can see here, this is the bridge bend command. And this is a simple model that I have opened in order to explain you how this bridge bend command works. So straight away, we can just go to bridge bend command. So bridge bend is nothing but whatever, whatever the name suggests, it will create a bridge between the two sheet metal components. So as you can see here, this is one uh, sheet metal uh, feature and this is one more sheet metal feature. And if you want to create a bridge between these two, uh, you can use this command. And you can see here the first option is uh, Z or U transition. As you can see here, uh, you need to select an edges. So I'm just going to select this edge and this edge. So as soon as you select this and it is asking for a point. So I'll just select this point. So as you can see here, once you select the point, uh, you will have one... Uh, you know transition bridge between these two sheet metal features and this is looking like a z so that is why the name called a z transition and if you want you can just give the full length over here and these options are similar to what we have discussed in flange command so if you want you can just give the dimensions or else if you want you can just give full length so this will have a full length bridge bend here so always you need to select in uh, uh, you know uh, the edges in which the if you are selecting the outer edge then here as well you need to select the outer edge if you are selecting the inner edge you need to select inner edge on the other side so i'll just click ok and we will give one more uh, bridge bend that is a u shape so in u shape what we have to do is if this is the case then i'm just selecting this outer edge and in the same way i'm just selecting this outer edge so as soon as you select you can see here we have an uh, uh, bridge with a U shape. So this is our U shape kind of uh, transition. So in the same way we have uh, some different different options over here and you can just click OK in order to get the bridge bend. So we have one more option called folded transition as the name suggests it will fold the uh, you know uh, transition. So here this is the outer edge and this is the outer edge and this is the inner edge and this is the inner edge. So what I'll do is I'll just select the outer edge and this outer edge. So once I select the outer edge and uh, you can see here uh, we have an folded kind of uh, uh, sheet metal transition. So we also have a uh, bend properties and which are uh, similar to what we have already discussed uh, in the previous uh, tutorial and we have a reference geometry. So this geometry will be uh, useful when we have a plane which is any other component is existing uh, nearby this bend so but then in that cases we can use this uh, uh, reference uh, geometry and we can create a plane and restrict uh, bend according to our uh, requirement guys so this is all about a uh, bridge brand guys please subscribe to my channel and hit the like button as well as share my videos thank you